Daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Emil Entertainment TV. Subscribe to the channel, follow us on all our social media platforms on Instagram, Prince Emil Entertainment, Facebook, or Prince Emil Entertainment, Facebook group, or Prince Emil Entertainment TV. We are available on Twitter at P Miller ENT. Follow us on Twitter and we we'll follow back. Welcome to another edition of our daily news, our breaking news, everyday news. Today is the 5th of uh, March uh, 2022. And uh, so, guys, uh, President Amnangagwa uh, said Zanu PF has no rule in the mandalas in fighting within the strife torn MDC and its variations. A party which has demonstrated to voters its incapacity and incompetent to run councils. The president told thousands of ruling party supporters who thronged Popa Jena said in Chaguti yesterday that since the opposition had demonstrated its incompetence and propensity for corruption, the electorate had an opportunity to vote them out in the upcoming by-elections on March 26. In terms of uplifting communities, the president said the government devoted 42 billion dollars for the devolution agenda, which takes development in local authorities and and has transformed lives across the country. When you look around, you see that our towns are in constant decay. This opposition lead councils have failed, and time has come to vote for people from ZANPF who have the expertise to run the councils. However, being ZANPF alone isn't good enough because next year we are going to vet aspiring councillors and see what they have achieved that warrants being elected in local authorities' governing structures, he said. Zimbabwe will next year hold harmonized elections and the bill is on, on table to set the minimum requirements for one to qualify as a councillor. But before the 2023 elections, the country will have a mini election with 28 by-elections for parliamentary seats and 104 polls for local authorities that emanated from recalls, deaths and dismissals. We are going for by-elections. Some seats came through deaths, but the majority came through recalls from parliament by the opposition. They are always plotting against each other, but they want to blame ZANU-PF. We have nothing with their troubles. The right to parliament and the person is, is recalled. In Chagutu, the president allowed the multitudes to back Chagutu Ward 9 candidate comrade Michelle Chianike. We have an opportunity to elect a candidate for Ward 9 comrade Michelle Chianike. Vote the NPF, a party that is the people at heart and that will respond to your needs. If you vote for a ZANU-PF councillor, it is easier for him to access my office because he would be from the ruling party and, and can come to the state house anytime, he said. Instead of resorting to violence or seeking foreigners to come back and repossess the land, which the president said was irreversible, political parties must seek peace, President Nangakwa said. Time has come to build the nation. You hear this young man, Nelson Chamisa, bragging that if he gets into state house, he will invite white people to help him rule. And I've said that can never, because a country can only be developed by its own. Investors can only come to Zimbabwe on our terms, not uh, to take back the country to former colonizers, he said. The president also can't get Mr. Chamisa's deputy and deputy who has uh, publicly stated that his party would reverse the land reform program, explaining an array of people focus initiatives that the second republic has come up with. The president said he is determined to implement development that leaves no one and no place behind, with dams being constructed in every province while climate proof agriculture and also infrastructure development is taking place. On infrastructure development, the Soviet Republic has come to the rescue of urban areas that have for the past 20 years been run to the ground by successive MDC councillors in all its variations. There are some parties that, that preach violence, but we want peaceful elections, he said. Focusing on Chegutu, the president assured the people in the small town that it is just over 100 kilometers from the capital city, Harare, that their challenges will be solved. I hate the challenges that we are facing in this province. There are some families who are facing evictions from their homes, mine houses and others and have said that will not happen. I also hear that people have been paying rentals for more than 20 years and that is also coming to an end as well will be issuing a title deeds, he said. The president who also planted a tree and led in the national cleanup exercise in the town was accompanied by political member, Comrade Chris Mchangwa, acting minister of, of environment climate change, tourism and hospitality industry, Honorable Sekesai Nzenza. 
Information and Communication Technology, Postal and Korea Services Minister Dr. Chen Fan Muskere, Minister of State for Marshall and West Provincial Affairs and Devolution, Mary Muliswa Chikoka, and Deputy Minister of Information, Publicity and Broadcasting Services, Corporate Kindness Paraza, attended the rally. At the rally, the NPF aspiring councillors drawn from across the province were introduced to the party supporters, while the president, who stressed the importance of ICT in modern learning, also ended over computers in Fupa Jena Primary and secondary Schools. The event packed program also saw former opposition leaders openly joining the NPF with their representative and former MDC legislator, Comrade Blessing Chabundo, assuring the president that many more were ready to join the revolutionary party and so guys that's the latest year of what happened yesterday in chegutu is it is saying that uh time is up for opposition political parties in urban areas he's saying that uh you need to vote for zanu pf um councillors so that uh they can easily get access to uh, resources to use in those areas because they can easily come to the state house direct and we are both magavotra munwe mdc can do ccc can do lead can do zanu ndonga as we talk to our concept we are office for president i was it and as we zanu pf he or she will be easily get access uh to meet his excellency the president of uh, zimbabwe uh, Emerson Minangagwa and it so that's the main reason why uh Maduro Bagawanda you know has to feel that uh you know team are problems are now because uh the ruling party in Benegishi Taura Zogwita and the Makantala Zadangare opposition political party. So I'm gonna about the very personal in the relationship between uh my councillors, my MPs with the ruling party. So uh, everything we are talking about usually for six months or a year just imagine about the man is supposed to be doing something uh city council but then got suspended because of a certain issue in the area and so guys got to in the comment section this is a daily news breaking news on prince miller entertainment tv thank you very much for listening and watching remember to like share comment and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that we do upload here